everyone. Uh, got a neat little project I'd like to show you here. Something I kind of built last night. Took me about five minutes. I made an emergency radio antenna for my 2 meter 440 uh, cheapy little bow thing. Uh, this is the adapter. I did have to buy this adapter from the, I think it's SMA or SA, I can't remember, to the uh, standard coaxial uh, SO239 or some crap like that. Uh, I made this wad of mess here. I'm going to show you something here. This was a piece of this standard coax, and I cut it. I stripped off the outer coating and peeled the shield off of the uh, insulated piece inside. Now I stripped off 19 and a half inches and then I stripped about a half inch to three quarters of an inch on the end of the insulated internal and I tied it around 12 foot of mess here. 12 foot of 550 cord, paracord or any kind of string would work. Uh, like I said, I did not invent this. I'm not a radio genius guy or something, but I thought I would try it, and it does work. Now the paracord is what I use to just hold the antenna up. Happy little granny knot kind of thing there. It doesn't have to be super tight because it's just temporary right here. Like everything I do is temporary. So, uh, that right there is a two meter half wave dipole. And you can play with your length and fold it over a little bit. You can strip off more and you can shorten it. Better to make it long and then fold it back to kind of tune it. Now I can't actually tune this because I'm still not licensed. But I have tried this on uh, a couple local repeaters. I've heard people talking. And this works really well, strangely. Like weird magic wizard stuff. It works really well. Now, first off, okay, I'm on a, a NOAA weather band here. Frequency band. Nothing, right? Okay, let's, let's plug it in. And this should pick up the weather band. antenna can't get out. This is a cool little roll-up antenna that you can keep in your pack. 12 foot of paracord. You can use for anything. You can use paracord for anything. Rain, of course. But yeah, I thought that was kind of neat. And it works. And it rolls up nice and small. And you can put it in your pack, in your pocket, in your glove box, in your car. Uh, standard SO239. Now for the little Bofang, you do have to have the adapter. Because Bofang is stupid, cheapy little Walmart crap. But it works. And it's awesome. Nice little, nice little easy 2 meter dipole, half wave. Pretty cool, man.